everybody, today I have my Ipsy and Birch box to share with you for July, and I know it's late, but my Ipsy actually took a little vacation um, through about five or six states, so I got it, um, I think, at the beginning of last week, so super late, Ipsy. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with Ipsy. Okay, so the theme this month is Sensationally Sunkissed, and then the back just shows all the brands that you could get in your box. And then there's another card in here for free shipping at Ulta um, with any Bare Minerals purchase, which you spend $50 to get free shipping anyway from Ulta, so yeah. Okay, the bag this month is just this pink scalloped bag. It's pretty cute, actually. Okay, and the first thing I got is a Pixie Tinted Brilliance Balm. Looks like that. Let's swatch it. Okay, so it looks like it's clear. You probably can't see that at all. So, I mean, I guess I'll get use out of it, but I do wish it had a little bit of a tint to it. And mine is in the color Unique Pink. The next thing I got is the Hang 10 Dark Tanning Oil, SPF 8. And I do use tanning oils. I wish I would have gotten it, you know, in the beginning of summer, but um, I'll definitely get some use out of that. Okay, next I have the... Marrakesh Ends Argan and Hemp Oil Therapy Split End Mender and Preventer and it's in the original scent and it looks like that. I'll definitely use this. Um, I love getting stuff for my hair because I don't always like to go out and purchase things for my hair. Um, and I'll, yeah, I'll definitely use this um, for split ends. So that's pretty cool. Good size. The next thing I have is from Wet, and it is a nail lacquer, and it is a really pretty cobalt blue color. I do own colors like this already, but um, I'll give the formula a try and see how much I like it. And this is the name of the color. Because I cannot pronounce that word. I've already tried about 15 times, so you can read it for yourself. <laughs> okay, and then the last thing that I got is from Bare Minerals. And it is a BB Advance Performance Cream Eyeshadow. So that's cool. And it is just this little baby sample. And it doesn't have a color. So let's swatch it. It's a nice base color, like a nice skin tone color for me. Um, let's see... Oh, it's in the color Barely Nude. And it does have a slight shimmer once you rub it in. But that's what it looks like. It's really my skin color. So that'll be really nice. Um, something to use other than my painterly paint pot. And next I have Birch Box. And I think this blue color is so cute. I did already cut it a little bit so I could get it out. And it is women's health themed. So the box is really cute. I remember, I think last year, um, me and Brittany threw away our women's health subscription. Um, there was like a free magazine offer in the box, and we threw that away. So hopefully this year, if they give it to us, um, I won't throw it away. And the theme this month is Power Up. And it looks like I got five things this month. I'm just going to open it. Okay, so pretty big samples that I can tell so far. The first thing that I got is the number four Prep and Protect Hair Protector. Looks like that. And I'll definitely use this. I um, use the heat protectant every day before I style my hair. And then the next thing is... Naobe Natural and Organic Body Radiance Lotion. Interesting. I don't really prefer to get lotions in my birch box just because I like Bath & Body Works a lot. Um, so let's see if this has like a sheen to it or something. Oh, 
Oh, it kind of smells like lemon. No sheen to it, but um, it's okay. The next thing I got was from Real Chemistry, and it is the Luminous 3-Minute Peel. It's cute packaging. So I'm guessing this is just like a facial peel, which I can use because I have some serious acne scarring and pigment. Little baby sample. So I'll definitely use that. And then next is in this little box. Okay, there's two things. The first is a Imperial Gardenia by Harvey Prince perfume. Mm, okay, so let's smell it. It's probably floral, and I hate floral. Yeah, so that is a straight floral, so not too impressed there. Oh, and then we did have the option to pick a sample this month, and I picked the Cynthia Rowley Lip Stain in Sugar. Let's open this and I'll swatch it for you. Finally got the wrapping off. Let's swatch it. Oh, that's a really pretty natural color. Um, they did have... I believe it was a darker pink, but I have a lot of bright pink, so I thought I would go with something um, more neutral that I would wear every day. Okay, and then there is something else in the box, and it says Power Up 12 Bite Size Challenges. So this is cute. It's like a little tip, tip book from Women's Health and Birch Box. And yay, they actually did include a um, full year subscription to Women's Health Magazine, so I will definitely not throw this away and sign up. So both boxes were pretty good this month. If I had to pick one, I would probably go with Birchbox. Just because of this little Cynthia Rowley lip stain. Um, I love lip products and I can definitely get some use out of this. Thanks so much for watching. If you get Birchbox or Ipsy, let me know below what you got differently this month, and I'll see you next month. Bye-bye.